Hey folks, welcome back to Bucket List 2 on Beefnopolis Gaming. I am Alex Beefna. Whoops. And I am going to... Okay, so for sure today we're going to get nutrient goo. Alright. Um, let me uh, just go real quick here. And those are copper. Good. I need you. Because I'm about to need a buttload of bronze for forestry machinery. Oh, God. Okay. Um, and copper has been hard to come by. Hey, 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 hey. See, I told you, this just happens sometimes. Um, I finally got it on camera. Alright, so how, how do we, how do we goo? It's water, um, some sort of meat or head or gibbs or zombie meat work. Chicken. Skull. Skull. I, I thought zombie meat worked. Um, I got some nether wart on my person, though. So. So for sure we're gonna get the nutrient goo. Um, whatever else we get. I mean, I can get raw chickens if it turns out zombie meat doesn't work. That's not a problem. Oh, God. Well, uh, oh, uh, oh dear. No. Uh, give... Give me the bucket of water, please. Get in the vat. In the vat. Okay. So here's some wort. Um, zombie meat? Give me... <laughs> yes, there's my torch. Alright. Water? There it goes. Okay. Okay, yeah, that, that should be fine. That should do it. That should do the thing. Say, what time is it? I, you know what? I don't need a clock. Um, all I have to do is <laughs> look it up in any eye and it will show there what time it is. Yeah. Hey. Alright, so not quite. I need more water. That's cool. That's fine. Beef no, you could just set up a, a thing with a accumulator and a plant in some pipes and some the water source is right there, my god. It's not like I have to go out to outer Mongolia to get water, okay? So, uh this morning well uh, let me backtrack a little bit. Not um for several years now we've had a Krispy Kreme under construction in my hometown. The first Krispy Kreme in the area, as far as I know. Um which is pretty wild. Because for some... I don't know what the deal is. There's some legal kerfuffle as to why we couldn't have one in in this market. I don't I don't even know. Um, okay, so there's the nutrient goo. So, um... They started building this Krispy Kreme actually several years ago. And some other sort of legal kerfuffle happened. I guess guess. What's in there? Okay, that's the presser. Um, and this Krispy Kreme, the, the skeleton, the tieback wrapped skeleton of this Krispy Kreme just goo. Just sat there for like two or three years not being worked on. Yeah, the sun's coming up. Alright, I can go check on the bees in a little bit. And then all of a sudden, uh, a couple of months ago, progress started to be made on it once again. And I, they didn't, I don't think they really announced any kind of an opening date or anything, but whatever. So I found out this morning that today was apparently the grand opening. Do you know how I found that out? Uh, I found that out as I was going to work. There was a massive traffic jam down my road down the road I go to to get to work and the head of the traffic jam hi was uh in the Krispy Kreme parking lot okay I heard another one behind me there so <laughs> okay Krispy Kreme's open good to know there's a line a block and a half stretching back from this damn Krispy Kreme okay uh, yeah alright how we doing cool cool alright 
Ah, ah, ah. Get away from my bees. Get away from my bees. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> anyway. So, um, as I'm coming home from work, I get caught in the same damn traffic jam. Yes, yeah, still a block and a half away from the Krispy Kreme. At 6 o'clock in the evening, people are still lined up a block and a half to get Krispy Kreme. I, I, beef dough, did you get some Krispy Kreme? No, I didn't because I couldn't get in the damn parking lot. I'm not going to sit there in my car waiting for an hour and a half just for a crispy friggin' cream donut. I'm not going to do it. I don't I don't care. I I mean, I'm sure they're good. I know they're good donuts, but I'm not going to sit in my car and wait that long for one. Right, I'm going to do a thing. Um a real quick like here. I'm going to pull up all these orberry bushes and we're going to make a nice safe or berry nursery. Uh, how are we going to do that? Very simple. Uh, let me get. Oh, you know what? I, I I forgot. I carved this out last week. Yeah. Just have to remember not to catch on fire. Okay. Um. Can I? I have enough wood to make it. Oh my god. Um. Let me unheck my inventory. Just a little bit here. Okay, all right. Okay. Gibbs. Okay. Eggs. There we go. Uh, let's file that under food, because why not? Shinies. Okay, uh, I, well, while I'm thinking about it. I have got to make, um, can you make a sunflower? I don't think you can. No, you have to get a sunflower to get liquid sunshine, so I'm going to have to do some exploring to find sunflowers. Oh, God. Uh, unless. Hang on. Is there another way other than sunflowers? There is not. Oh, farts. Okay. Alright. Okay. So, um, yeah. I'm going to... There's some... Sl I, okay, I don't really want to use wood slabs. Um, I don't want to mess with the aesthetic over there. Just give me the door. Uh, do I have any stone slabs chilling? I don't. But, boy oh boy, can I. Let me uncompress that. My nose itches. Um. Let me scratch my nose. Ah, there we go. That's that's not how you slab. No, no, that's definitely not how you slab. <laughs> that's how you slab. Okay, twenty-four maybe uh, might be enough. Maybe. Okay. Let's see. Let me get another, uh, another little bunch there. Okay. Uh, uh, now I think it's this way. Actually, I could, I could just go this way. Yeah. There's the, there's the orberry room. All right. So. Now orberries grow best in the dark. The problem is, um, other things that grow best in the dark include monsters that want to eat my face. However. If you put slabs down, like so... Ah! Aha! Nothing will spawn on them. Oops, well, that one something would spawn on because it's a whole block high. If it's just half a block high, nothing will spawn. Yeah, this is this is not a new thing. Oops. Yeah, and I'm short some. Okay, uh, I'm gonna throw this down just for now, just to keep anything from spawning on that one bit there. Okay, just really um, that 
ought to be more than enough. Let me uncompress a couple of cobbles here. So I'll have, uh, so I can build up to put the door down. Alright, give me that. Okay. Give me cobbles. Now I should still be able to get in this damn door, right? Uh, no. No, I cannot. That's okay. Alright. Oh god, what just happened? Um. <laughs> uh. Oh dear. That that can't be right. Uh let me relog and um yeah, B BRB. Okay. Okay, now that Um, this, this is some gate to hell stuff here. Wow. Um, I, I don't like that. So you know what I'm gonna do? Oh, God. Um, why? Why does it do that? What the entire damn hell? That's freaky. That is just absolutely freaky. Does it have to do with the slabs? So, um, what if, what if I took the door out? Take the door away. Alright, I, I, I don't like it. <laughs> no, sir, I don't like it. Okay. So, um, okay, so if I F7... All right, well, nothing's going to spawn in there. I I don't like it. I don't like that whole thing. So here's what... Uh, <laughs> yeah, let's just... Um, let's just... Let's just forget we ever saw that door. Because um, that, that ain't right. That ain't natural. That That's just... Uh-uh. No. <laughs> no. Alright, how many more brushes do I have? Um, aluminum and essence. Alright. But nothing's going to spawn in here. Okay. That's the important part. Uh, <laughs> that was just bizarre. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Give me the slabs. And I'll just pop, pop, and pop, and pop. Okay. See, this one's already grown a little bit. So, if I just, uh, yeah, just uh, darken the room up a little, and just uh, let them do their thing. Okay. <laughs> the hell? That is the weirdest damn thing I have ever seen, I swear to God. And I have seen some weird <coughs> in this game. Let me tell you, internets. <laughs> oh, man. I'm just going to put these in my body. Um, oh, I've got some copper, too. How about that? So, copper. 25 ingots. Well, damn, I need that. I need the tin. I need the tin that I put away upstairs. I put a buttload of tin right there. Okay. Let's just uh, hum that right into the smeltery. There's a little bit of bronze. So what do I got? What do I need first? I think I need a squeezer first. No, I need a centrifuge first. Eh? Alchemical centrifuge. Oh, yeah, I gotta get into thumb crap too, don't I? 
Okay, so I need glass. I need eight bronze with the sturdy casing. And then six copper. Okay. Wondering if I ought not to just go ahead and get... Well, too late now. <laughs> too late. Uh, <laughs> there, there was a thought. The thought did not come in time. Oh, man. Uh, that's okay. That's all right. So, um... What else do I need to... Hey. Oh, God, what did I do? Oh. What else can I do with the sturdy casing? Analyzer. The carpenter. The bottler. The fermenter. I'm going to need one of those. Okay, I'll be able to make a fermenter. Uh, that, the centrifuge, of course. The moistener. The squeezer I will need eventually. That takes tin. The ceramic fabricator. I ought not to need the steel I might need. Mailbox, the rain tank. Alright, so basically none of that crap. But I can I can probably go ahead and make the fermenter, because I'm gonna need that to make oh god. Biomass or biofuel or bio something or other. A sand? No sand. Um here, make sand. How do you what do you do with flour anyway. Oh, you just smelt it and turn it into bread. Well, here, give it. Give me it. I'm hungry. Here, take that. Take that. Yeah, just throw a bag of flour in the oven. Get you a nice loaf of bread. Mm, boy. Okay. Actually, uh, here. Give me that. And, uh, bake that instead. I'll just eat this uh, lump of burned flour. Mmm, yummy. Okay. Do I happen to have any tin left over? Three ingots. Mm -hmm. Let me go ahead and get some more bronze out. So give me that. Give me a casing. So. Firm. Four bronze gears, and how do you bronze gear? I need four ingots of iron for that, which should not be a problem. I've got a butt ton of bronze right there. Give me that. How are we on iron? We're good on iron for now. Okay, uh, I think I might just hook all this crap up outside. Because I've got that wind turbine out there. And that might make it a little easier. Okay. Oh, fudge. Here. Give me that. Okay. For each bronze gear. Hey, give, give me the casing. Give me the glass. Here, I cook the rest of that. Okay. Let's go plug this in outside. Actually, do I have room to plug it in in here? I might or might not. Hup, hup. I do. It, it ain't pretty. <laughs> but I do. Okay, so fruit juice, water, or honey. Biomass or short mead. Okay, and of course it's not going to tell me here. So, uh, how do you make biomass? Biomass is uh, saplings and fertilizer or mulch or compost. How do you make mulch? Yeah, that's in the carpenter, the moistener, the squeezener, the transposer? Really? Wait, you put any old fruit in there? Hold that thought. Why am I going that way? I have a tunnel. 
Don't I have like a crap ton of apples? I have a apple. Um, I have some potatoes. I have corn. Let's try those. Where are you? Ten. I'm gonna need you. Okay. Um, hey, there we go. Now, what are you making? Fruit juice. No sh <coughs> Excuse me. No, doesn't work with corn. Doesn't work with the potatoes. It's gotta be apples. Okay. Okay. Alright. Okay. Okay. I think I got more apples. Um, let's put that away, because that don't work. I think I have more apples upstairs. Uh, I, I don't got... And I don't... Let's see, let's try the pumpkin. Um, I don't think that uh, any of this is going to work with that, though. But I need fruit juice, too. Let's go upstairs. Um, see... I, I got no, uh, no eats in here. I got saplings out the yin-yang. Um, of course. Okay, so let's just try. Where am I going? What am I doing? Let's just try the pumpkin. See whether... What? Stop! Pumpkin? Pumpkin does not count. Sapling? Does not count. I have less than a bucket of fruit juice here. Um... Okay, so what I can do is I can go to bed. Down here. So I don't get... Yeah. <laughs> A little salty. Ow, my foot's asleep. Okay. Alright, so now I can go back up. Okay, let's find some apple-bearing trees. Let's fix my mattock first. Alright, find some apple bearing trees. Get the killing iron ready just in case. Okay. Alright. How are you doing? Cool. Alright. That's a rubber tree. That's not what I want. Hey, hey, buddy. Hey. Ooh, nice. Okay, so we gotta find, like, an oak tree. Uh, there's, uh... Rubber trees, hither and yon. I don't think we're gonna find oak trees in the snow. There's birch. So there's probably oak. Off that away. I see you. Did it just despawn? Okay. Whatever, just leave me alone. One of those god awful bees. Okay. I, I see oaks. I see oaks. I can't make that jump though. That's okay. These weird cows. Hey. Hey, hey, hey. Apple cow. Oh, give, give, give. Thank you. Surprised I don't get baked apples from that, actually. <laughs> okay. Vein miner is, is a thing. Random things is not. That's right. No apples. Really. Not a one. Are you an apple cow? Apple cow. Oh, hey. Hi. How you doing? Uh, listen, I, I need your apples. Thank you. Alright. Okay. No apples, but saplings. Okay. 
Why, why do none of you drop apples? I really need apples. Really bad. That actually will be enough to get me a thing of fruit juice, though, won't it? And I can plant the saplings by the house. So I don't have to come out here to Outer Mongolia. To BFE. To get apples anymore, right? Right. Now there's probably about 50 squajillion apples just chilling in the basement, but we're not going to go there today. We're just not going to go there. I've had, hey, what are you? Oh, it's a frog. Okay. Where's the house? Oh, crap. Uh, I'm lost. House. There we go. Uh, what are, what are you? A coin. Okay, well, I just morphed into a coin. I have no idea what that means. Spawn coin. Um, that, that strikes me as possibly very dangerous. Coming as it does from Orspawn, the mod responsible for that son of a gun over there. Uh. <laughs> I've actually had to disable some of the mobs from Orspawn, in particular the termites. Because I, I, we've got to go to that village someday so I can show you. I watched these termites devour an entire village. Uh, the buildings, I mean. Um, what? Ooh, a hive, a hive, a hive. Um, where's my scoop? Oh, it's in my hand. <laughs> Give me... Oh, God! Here. Give me your bees and let me out of here. Okay. <laughs> oh boy. Get my killing iron back out. Hi. Yeah. Okay. Give me some oak saplings. Hi. Yeah. I just throw some oak saplings around here. Let's get some apple barren trees for future use. Okay, let let's go squish these apples. Let me go check on the bees here real quick first. Hi bees. Oh, you made a comb. Good for you. I can't do anything with it yet, but you made a comb. Very happy for you. Let's put it away. No, nope, let's put it with that. Put that B in there. Okay. Good God. All right. Um. That way. Check on my berries. Yeah. See, look, they're they're already growing real good. Okay. Get down, buddy. All right. Uh, shove some apples in here. Oh, I thought I might have enough. I, I may not. Okay, there's a mulch. I, I don't quite have enough for fruit juice, but that's okay. Put you in there. Put you in there. I have no buckets. I have not a bucket. And I left all my iron upstairs, didn't I? I sure did. Okay, look. Um, where's iron? Six ingots. Okay, just just give me ingots. It's fine. Just give me the ingots. I'll make the bucket. I'll make a bucket. Right here. Okay. All right. me that. Oh, there it goes. Not, oh, wait, wait. Not quite a bucket. Okay, it's fine. All good. All fine. Oh, hi, buddy. And there we go. All right. Give me a bucket of biomass. Woohoo! Sweet. 
and we'll go put it upstairs. And we'll call it a day. Yep. And we've filled up that set of shelves, too. How about that? Oh, boy. Um... We'll, we'll climb up there if we have to. You stay out there. You you stay out there. You leave me alone. All right. And biomass done. All right, folks. I'm going to call it a day. I'm going to get the wasp spray. <laughs> what the hell? Okay. So I'm going to call it a day. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.